Hi guys, it's Minx here. Hope you're doing well. We're playing some more Murdered Cell Suspect today. It's pretty sad news. The guys who made this uh, airtight game closed down, I believe, the other day, which is a shame because this game's really good and it presumably should have done better there than it than it did. It's a uh, shame. I really wish there were more story-driven titles and stuff like that out here in the gaming world. Anyway, I guess we're going to explore this basement further. Oh god, what the hell happened here? Find out what the bell killer's been up to. What the hell happened down here? Well, I guess we're gonna find out. Who the fuck is that? Stern judging accusing. This is from the You claim righteousness, but you know your guilt and cannot deny your punishment is due. So that's from, like, the witch trial days. That's, like, a really old memory. Oh, it's the girl. I recognise her. Pleading, imprisoned. There we go. You stood for justice. How is this just? So she was a, a victim here, I guess. This, uh, I guess we're going to have to talk to her to find out what happened. I bet this is gonna link back to the bell killer somehow, maybe a descendant of him or a copycat of him or something. I'm not quite sure why those candles are relevant, but still. What's this? It's the bell killer symbol. Okay, violins, calm down. I know we're finding some creepy stuff, but you need to remain a bit calmer than you are. What's in here? A prison inside a prison. Okay, they were really terrible, obviously, here. Yeah. And like an extra cell here, like a secret room. Oh, hang on, that's not the investigation room, is it? What is it? I can't f see. This room is really creepy. Why does it exist? Can I look at that or not? What happened down here? Um, righteous man in prison, girl. You claim righteousness, but you know your guilt and cannot deny your punishment is due. I thought you stood for justice. How is this justice? You tell him. The courts are not a place for your murderous whimsy. You are a corrupt heathen. The families of those innocent souls you executed through false accusations oh. of witchcraft will exact their righteous justice tonight. False accusation? So she was killed for lying? What is that nonsense you draw? My mark will burn like a brand in the flesh of this town. It takes me to the ends of eternity. I will personally make the bell toll for every witch oh, in Salem. So she's a witch hunter that was accu uh, uh, executed for accusing people falsely. The guy who killed me is... Abigail. The bell killer's a chick? She might be the bell killer. How is that possible? I gotta get out of here and figure out how to track her down. I reckon she's possessing a dude. Oh, that's really cool. But what what an interesting twist. We have a new suspect. You realize how crap this building looked outside? I, can't, I couldn't remember it looking this crap, but I guess it does. Through the fence, dude. Are we right at the end of the game? This could be the final no chapter. One deserves to be murdered. And when the psycho trying to kill someone pretends there's some grand justice behind it, that just makes it all the more twisted. What the hell happened here? Well, I guess the bell killer came here and did shit, but you know what I mean. Oh, wonderful. Most fun ever. Oh, God. The desire to call this video shite at the museum is really high, but... You know. There's the bell killer. Joy! Not another step. Oh, it's Rex. Great. Rex is no, the fucking bell killer. Rex. This has nothing to do with her, Abigail. Oh, but How can he see me? For 300 years, we have executed the witches who corrupt our fair city. Down there. 
Let's go. Those who try to mask their demonic contract and leverage powers they should never possess. Just like you have. Don't you dare compare me to her! <laughs> easy, easy. Put your hands up! Help! Don't do anything stupid. Hands up! Stop what you're doing. Hands up! Do it now! This is so confusing. Uh, she's being possessed. Abigail, stop! That's not good. Rex, you piece of shit. What are you doing? This is not, not good. Now. This was you. We did kill you as well, dude. Once you're getting closer to the truth. Ronan, do something! What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Hold tight, kid. I'm on my way. Hold tight. Uh, 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 powerful scream. Bye, Bell Killer, fuck face. Oh my god, this is epic! Please be okay. It's over, Abigail. Why was she so nice to me when I fucking was there at the beginning? I'm gonna poltergeist that shit. Well, I'm dead. No. 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 Joy. Well, she's dead. Got to try that again. Okay, let's try this again, guys. I've got I've got an idea on what to do if I don't fall down a fucking hole full of demons first. Right. Okay, we go over here. Possess her, influence, powerful scream. Grab Abigail's arm. Here we go. Didn't that never popped up the first few times, I swear. The time is upon us, Abigail Williams. No. You scourge of Salem. It is time to pay for your sins! This can't be happening. You want to use memories against me? You can play at that game. I know the truth about your death, but I still don't know the truth about mine. Did you use Rex to kill me? Did you use Rex to kill me? Rex was my most influential. The most respected, the most feared official in town. Of course I did. How can Rex be the killer? How could Rex have done it? Rose's killer had blue eyes. I didn't use the same killer for every murder. Ah, oh, so it's a different Val killer each time. Baxter. Why kill Baxter? Why did you kill Baxter? I eventually kill all the killers I use. Especially the ones who get close to the truth. Ah, so no one had an idea they were being used, I guess? Why did you kill me? I wasn't close to the truth in the apartment. I wasn't one of your killers. Why did I have to die? Because he used him to kill... 
Oh my god. He was one of the killers. What a twist. No. I wouldn't. No. No, no. I, She's been systematically I possessing different I? people, including him. You made me kill her. Great time event. If I'm going out, you're coming with me. Gotcha. Gotcha, little Abigail. No. No. Welcome to hell, fuck face. Well, we killed her, but we're responsible for the death of the girl who drowned. That's why she shot herself and ran away from us. <coughs> we all got a dark side. Sometimes obvious. Sometimes not. If we're lucky, we keep our dark side hidden. By law, Rex was a killer. But the law doesn't always see the truth. Fortunately, Joy did. And she would never press charges. <laughs> she might even help Rex cover his tracks. One thing's for certain. She's a better person than I was at that age. Kid who deserves forgiveness. She's paid her dues. And committing a few small crimes searching for your mom? Well, even the coldest cops would forgive those. And there's her mom. Mom! Oh, that's quite a happy ending, despite all the murder. Hasn't been a bell killer murder since the night Abigail met her final end. But the case never officially closed. But memories fade, time heals. With luck, Salem will move on and find peace. Death repays debts, my father always said. Forever I believe that. But truth be told, this life ain't over until you're honest about what you owe. Set everything right. Settle your debts. Only then. Can you move on? Ronan? No, oh, he's gonna go with his wife. That's pretty sweet. And that's uh, Murdered Star Suspect. Bit of an abrupt end, I feel, but I did enjoy that. Um, if you enjoyed the series, remember to leave a like, a favour, a comment, and let me know what you'd like to see from me next, because I'm actually not quite sure. Got a few ideas, but let me know. And um, we'll continue Murdered Soul Suspect uh, at some point soon. Uh, bye for now, everyone. See you really soon. Have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing day. And uh, yeah, more dark adventure type games to come soon from myself. Bye.